gang and I air it out. We slime and I bang it up. We banging a wind up. It's red and we pour it up. My diamonds they glowing up. She wet and she wanna fuck. Be patient, I'm counting up. All right, what is up, guys? RV stuff back here once again, and today we're gonna be taking a quick look at these Alexander McQueen low tops. These are from a new seller, so I'll go over all the information in the video. If you don't um, like UA products, you can click out the video. That's what these are. Um, they are not retail, so it's just for educational purposes only. With that all out of the way and being said. If you are new to the channel and you do like what you see, show your boy some love, subscribe, turn on notifications, drop a like on the video, follow my Instagram at RVStuffTV, link is in the description. Appreciate all the love, guys. Uh, let's keep the channel growing, of course. Couldn't keep, uh, you know, pumping these videos out um, as often as I even do now. It's nowhere near as much as I used to do it before, but I just have way too many things. So, um, but yeah, I appreciate all the love, though, guys. Anyways. Let's tap in to these shoes real quick. I'm not trying to waste y'all day away. So um, these are from a new seller, like I mentioned. All um, Some of the information will be in the description. Most of it won't, so that's why I'll go over it here. So they are from hypekick.ru. WhatsApp's right there. Instagram at cherish underscore kicks too. The email right there. And then if you use the code RV stuff, you can save yourself $10 on the website. So just to let y'all know um kind of before i get into uh the shoes these took about uh i'd say like two weeks to get here give or take i am pleased with the quality i already wore these shoes out um once so if you do see some scuff marks and wear here and there that's why and um yeah that's basically it so with that out of the way let's get into it um boxes uh bubble wrapped double box as well so no problems with the shipping there here we can see the box. Typical Alexander McQueen um, raised font here. Kind of dirty just because I sat the shoes on top of the box um, after wearing them. On the side here, that's basically all it is to these boxes. On the side, you got the tag. These are size 47, which translates to roughly 12 and a half US. Um, I did take the insole out and I wore them all day. They were quite uncomfortable midday. Um, just because they're a little tight, I typically wear 13. Designer shoes typically fit a little bit tighter as well, in my experience at least. So um, as opposed to like, you know, Retro J's or Air Forces or whatever, right? So, but yeah, so I digress. That's all the information here. Let's pop the box open for y'all. Inside here, we got a, uh, these are actually the, the laces the shoes came with. I switched them out for the black pair. They also came with as well. Just think it looks super clean. Um, beyond that, this little bag the laces come in. I saved a sticker for the bottom. That was on the bottom of, I believe, the right shoe. Um, then you got the little size stickers, blah, blah, blah. Alexander McQueen dust bag. And that's basically it. Besides that, you just get paper with the little Alexander McQueen logo all over. But... Yeah, that's basically it. Oh, you do get this little thing as well, which I assume has some paperwork in there um, to do with the materials of the shoe, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I don't really know. Let's see. Curiosity. Yeah, so there's the first page. Y'all can pause it if you want to read that. Um, but, <clears throat> yeah, I'm not going to go over that stuff too in depth. I don't really care to read y'all a novel. Came here for the shoes and that's what I'm gonna be reviewing, but just thought I'd show y'all what else came with. But here are the shoes themselves. Super clean. Um, you know, just a clean show overall. This is my second pair of Alexander McQueen's. Um, my other pair, I forgot what the colorway is. I haven't pulled them out in a long time just cause I typically don't rock designer shoes just because of how uncomfortable they are on my big feet so yeah um but yeah man overall super clean here's the back it's kind of the only little dab of color you can see i scuffed them up already there that was not there from the seller but yeah i mean honestly i couldn't really see anything wrong with the shoes you can see leather creasing up when you wear them obviously um but it does feel 
really good actually um the problem area i found with my big feet um in these shoes is around here where um i have my bone obviously that connects to my big toe and that tends to push up against here which yeah not the most comfortable thing in the world to wear obviously with leather it takes a while to break in as well i'm sure these will be more comfortable after wearing um, them a few times for long periods as they stretch and whatnot but yeah so overall super clean you can see the tongue underneath the tongue has a size and some other numbers insole this is alexander mcqueen made in italy underneath the insole it's just a uh, cork thing that says the tie uh the size and then um it says cup sold and yeah that's pretty much it um i did wear these without the insole in there which also adds to the uncomfortability because you have no support it's just literally cork on the bottom of your foot but it makes the shoe a lot tight a lot less tight which is good so um overall i do like them a lot i did wear these in when it was snow and salt on the ground but y'all can see regardless how the bottom of the shoes look. You know, pretty typical. I don't know if this is like an official colorway that um, Alexander McQueen released. Don't really care, honestly, because they have so many different um, colors and stuff that it's hard to even keep track or follow. But yeah, I think overall, though, this is a fire colorway. Um, just, I don't know. Just the way it looks, it's super sleek. It's like a pair of low cut docks um, or something like that with the black flat laces. Kind of has like a satin look, kind of looks gray um, when you go over it. It's just dope, man, I like it. So that's the right shoe. The left, you can see I scuffed these as well. Same, same area, so. Um, but yeah, same thing. Straight stitches, no glue marks. Super clean overall, man. Super, super clean. So, for the money, can't really complain. Even like the natural creasing as I wore them looks pretty dope in my opinion. Um, on black leather at least. Same thing on the inside. And yeah, man. Y'all get the gist basically it for these um let me know your guys thoughts comment section down below of course as per usual if you are new to your channel please show some love show some support not just to me to every other creator in this game right now um that has been here for a while like i'm one that has been here for a while it's been gosh i don't even know how long it is it's probably been like four years that i've been doing it um drier periods here and there depending on how often i'm picking things up but regardless been in the game for a while um always been you know most importantly trying to help y'all out and showing y'all what you get for the quality you know what you pay for that sort of stuff right so at the end of the day you guys you can pay for what you want you can buy what you want but you don't know necessarily what you're going to be getting unless other people are buying it and reviewing it and showing you and that sort of stuff so um anyways i'm on a tangent so i'm gonna let y'all go hopefully enjoy the rest of your day stay safe y'all um follow me on instagram at rv sub tv and with that being said and out of the way stay safe stay blessed and i'll catch y'all in my next video peace